So my friend Lisa really doesn't like any petroleum products at all. In fact, she was kind of freaked out one day when she came in and found me making her boiling water for coffee with a propane tank. Uh, she was sure we were all going to die from carbon monoxide poisoning. She drives an electric car. She has solar cells in her house. What can I say? She loves electric things. So she loaned me this German induction heater. My forerunner has an inverter. It's got a 120 volt plug. I just plug this little puppy in, in my car, versus burning coffee uh, or burn, uh, boiling water with propane. So what do we have here? Well, first of all, got to have coffee. I mean, it's pretty low on Maslow's hierarchy of needs. It's down there at the base of that pyramid. I have two cups, same size. Both have four cups of water in them. We'll light these guys on fire, and we'll just see who boils up first. One, 125 or so, headed towards 130. And we got over here. Oh, oh, 150, 160. Oh, I think we know who's going to win here. I really do. Yeah, we're holding steady at 138 right there. One sixty five, seventy, seventy five, one eighty, one ninety. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to declare a winner quite yet. I would like to give my old friend Propane the benefit of the doubt. It is at one fifty now. One fifty. Mm. Over 190. We're hitting 200. And worth a rolling boil. Let's check the time on that. Under four minutes for our friend the induction heater. Good old propane still trying to do its thing. Now propane will keep your hands warm in the morning, but this will make coffee a lot faster. This wins, unless it drains the battery on my truck. <laughs>